my beloved love. And it's like this particular masculine energy is beginning to realize that very grand truth that you, divine feminine, are like that force of nature, and they're in awe of you, even as they feel, feel your frequency is creating so much upheaval in their life. It's like they recognize at some deeper level that this upheaval is necessary to bring them back into alignment with their truest, most authentic self. So lay even in awe of the tower moment that you've sparked within them. Wow, that might have been one of the most interesting messages to come through these readings. And of course, all of you listening here are co-creators, so thank you for being part of that co-creative process. I feel that this entire reading has actually been meant to lead us to that message. Again, I really didn't know where it was going to go today, but what a beautiful and interesting full moon message that we've co-created here. So I'm going to pull one final Rumi Oracle card to close the reading. Of course, if I resonate with you, I invite you to subscribe to the channel. Join our beautiful community of like-minded, conscious, creative beings here on YouTube. You can also follow me on Instagram at Magnetize Yourself. And the final Rumi card is a new gown. Weary and consumed by longing, I was caressed by my beloved last night. My wounded soul was set free when I tasted the sweetness of love. My spirit was lifted at once. I surrendered my life while overflowing with joy, and my vision was filled with light. Love said, Don't feel so hopeless, my weary and gloomy one, for my generosity is beyond forgetting. Those devoted to me see how boundless divine justice can be. Behold my immeasurable kindness. Love embraced my spirit, and all my doubts vanished at once. A new and glorious robe of honor was placed on my shoulders. Love offered me the power of new vision and the transforming touch of divine generosity and placed the chalice of eternal wine in my hand. Rumi and the guidebook also says, your royal heritage has been revealed, and in seeing the divinity within yourself, you become blessed to see it in all beings. All beings returning to the realization of royalty within. Crazed searching outside of the heart will come to an end. You finally ascend your throne and claim your divinity once and for always. Wow, what a beautiful way to close the reading. Again, thank you so much for all of you tuned in here today. I am sending you all so much love. It is super late. It's actually like two in the morning where I am right now. And needless to say, I very rarely record content at this time. Typically, I am sleeping. But also, sometimes I've noticed that some of the most powerful downloads come through at night. And my theory for this is because the collective energy around us tends to be a bit quieter. So we're able to pick up on more of those ethereal, esoteric kinds of energies without being bombarded with so much collective noise. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.